All right, yes, you're welcome back to the Balanced Diet Alternative Meds. I don't know why today just feels like a Friday to me because of the caliber of people that I get for inside studio. Because just they do me like today, they do tini ni, ta na na, ta na na, tini ni. Well, on top of the Balanced Diet Alternative Meds, this one we get a Nadja Kajit guest. This one, a person with a hit record, and in record, don't they recognized by the Guinness World Record because of what he don't do? While well, some people they still try to find a battle shop for early morning, this guy has targets. He don't set goals for himself, and these goals, you know, they meter one by inch even as the year done the start some people are getting ahead and they're getting a good head start um you're going to, need to you're going to, need to make welcome for me this morning we get jason usoro in the building he is a guinness world record holder welcome to the show um jason yeah thank you very much just what would be your much. native name um actually i'm joshua marcus usoro my um that's that's my real name joshua marcus usoro uh -huh. yeah um but jason is Jason is also is, also has the same meaning as Joshua, but Joshua is Hebrew, Jason is English. English, exactly, yeah, so, exactly. Yeah. Okay, so you're welcome to the show. So yeah, Jason, I know that they see Guinness World Record here. Yeah. They see their certificate for here. Mm -hmm. We know this is not this is not fake. This is authentic. Mm -hmm. This is a the yeah. original of the original. Tell mm -hmm. us what thing you do when Guinness can't recognize you for the thing where you do and the plan where they get. What exactly happened? Okay, um, we just broke the longest dance marathon. By relay. Longest dance, dance marathon. marathon by relay. Explain what in that one means. Okay, longest dance marathon is a dance marathon you have to dance for, dance for as long as possible. Okay, this is this is the longest dance marathon by relay. Um, we have a team of dancers who oh. yeah um, who dance at different points to accumulate. Oh. No breaks. No so breaks. one person go dance with this time, yeah. and another person go take as over. As possible, yes. And then, then the other person will take over. over. Oh, yeah. it'd be like relay race, so you yeah, run, but this one are dancing, one now be. Aha. Uh -huh. There are no breaks, non-stop, so you have to, so we dance. And for, you dance on your feet? Yes. For 53 yeah. hours, non-stop. Eh? Yes. 53 hours? No breaks. Three days plus? Two, Two days, days plus. plus? Yes. Wow. Mm -hmm. How they return monitor? Because me, I go sleep in between if I watch. If yeah. I be one of your, if I be one of the observers. <laughs> yeah, because um, the um, while while actually doing the event, you have to have like cameras on you twenty four seven, so it's recording twenty four seven, no breaks, no. What was the objective? What did they really try to get at the end of the day? What's the objective of the of the non stop dance relay? I don't get. Why they be the oh, Okay, yes. Um, okay. Um, on things that I've been dancing for a very very long time. Like I told you, I had my first um, attempt in 017 for the longest dance marathon by an individual. That was just me. I danced for 63 hours, so I didn't break that record. So I've been dancing for a very long time, and I'm like, okay, how can I make best use of this dance? That's how the idea came. Actually, it was dropped in my spirit to go ahead to do the Guinness World Record. So I started this journey. I was thinking I, was thinking I was going to break this record in like seven months, six, seven months. But it took me like two years plus. <gasps> so, yeah, here we are. Wow. Mm -hmm. So now with this recognition, tell us some of the benefits you don't get with the recognition. Um, deals have been coming from left, right, and everything. Deals have been coming, and um, yeah, deals have been coming, and it's kind of opened a lot of doors. You know. Wow. I nobody yeah. ever think I'm saying there would be something like this, um, mm -hmm. dance marathon relay, mm -hmm. and Guinness World Record actually come notice. Of. It's a very, very beautiful one. Yeah. So I know say with this one now, you don't talk and say doors don't open. Tell yeah. us about one or two of the doors where they lead to the events where you get. Okay, uh, okay, let me just um, tip you. Okay, there's, um, I've been called to be a judge on, on a show. Okay. Yeah, you get to know about the show with time. So really, um, yeah. apart from dancing, which other, which other passion you, did, you get okay. again? Or which other thing will you do? Okay. Because some people, they're out there where they get what they like. But mm -hmm. maybe at this point in time, you know, if you put food on top of their table. Mm -hmm. So they think of other things where they feel do. Yeah, so for you now, what thing you be they do before you jam this Guinness World Record okay. situation? Okay, um, I actually have an IT company, and uh, but I came into the industry as a singer. So I sing too and I dance, but I have an IT company. I have some like side businesses and stuff. So when you get this idea about mm -hmm. doing this relay, how you be get information, say Guinness World Record, they actually hold an activity like this in terms of dance marathon? Yeah, um, I, I actually did my research. I did my research. Uh -huh. I researched about it, and it was um, actually the current record was held by a Tesco dance beat, 30 hours. So I did my research before attempting the record. Approached um, on Guinness World Record. They said, "Okay, go ahead." So oh, so you actually reach out to them. Yes, you reach out to them. Say so you want to participate for yes, inside you want the to, competition. Yeah, you want, that, you, that you want to actually attempt. Attempt. So once they say, "Okay," they'll give you all the rules. They'll give you everything to do. So once they give you the rules, you go ahead and actually attempt. 
then you forward all the documents needed. It took me about three months to prepare all the documents and upload. Wow. It was crazy. Right? How many how many on that beef on that team? Where, where did um, this relate? Eighteen. 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 Yes. And nobody went against nobody tried to say, I don't tire. Say my leg they pay me of some sort. My make I break small a little bit. Once, once. How long did you guys practice? This 18 as a team, how long would I practice mm. before when I come together and say, okay, we are finally ready okay. for this? Okay, um, it took about two months, two months to have that done. Every day yeah. for two months? Not actually every day, but like two months, like once a week to have that done. Wow. Mm -hmm. And on a test, how many times before the, before the main competition, Shelley? Okay, okay, actually, what actually helped was me doing it in 017. The experience I got from the 017, the one that happened in 2017, really, really helped to, to put us on track for this one that we did. So it actually made it quite easy for us to actually achieve. So do you, like the 017 one made it quite easy. I did try, I'm, I'm just mm -hmm. trying to imagine and think because um, um, for you, how you would take no, say this part where you, did, where you want to enter, so mm -hmm. now the right part for you, now your destiny. Now your Akada, mm -hmm. according to some Yoruba people, they talk about how you be taking notes. This part where they follow was the path you were meant to be in. Because this was the first thing I discovered. I knew I, I actually knew how to do. I discovered I first discovered dance. I could dance when I was like five. So I've been dancing ever since then. And although I have some other businesses on the side, but I know that I still have a purpose when it comes to dance. So I, can, I could use dance to achieve a lot. So that's why I'm still here doing dance. Now talk about the challenges. No, talk about some of the challenges because we know mm -hmm. it wasn't the bed of roses. Mm -hmm. We know so you know you know easy at all. Mm -hmm. Tell us some of the challenges where you be faced, where be almost make you want quit this mm -hmm. this course where you be on top. There were there were there were a lot. For example, um, having to do my first attempt and I failed publicly, it was very very discouraging. And um, then coming back again, um, you know before you can do this kind of attempt, you need like 24 hours light. You know how it is here in Nigeria. You need internet. You need um, there's there's a lot that goes down. Like, um, so the, the, the real work comes after the attempt. Preparation of documents. It took me like a month to organize all, um, to, to actually organize all the documents, um, organize all the videos. I actually had about 200 gigs of data, you, which you have to upload online. Hmm. So it took me about two months now to upload. So about three months altogether to prepare as like it was crazy. Then after that, you submit. Then it takes about three months for them to go through everything and approve. So about six so months. So that's six months already. Half six of a year already. Work out go. Has already, has already gone. Whoa. Already. So um, that's why we actually did the attempt in April, but it was approved by December. Um, then then the, our presentation was on the 29th of February. That was like that's like a, a week, week ago. ago. So yeah. Beautiful. Now, I know yeah. since to open different doors for you and have different opportunities for mm -hmm. you. But for people where they're back now, yeah. where they try in their own different perspective and mm -hmm. respective careers, they try doing different. They mm -hmm. try um, try something new, mm -hmm. you know, for inside their field. What do you to tell them? What advice can you give to those people? Okay, um, I would say um, it's never easy, but don't give up. No matter how you feel, no matter how bad it gets, don't just give up. Don't give up. Do not give up. That's oh. all I would say. Do not give up. Yeah. Wow, thank you so much. It's quite inspiring. I'm just trying yeah. to imagine dancing for how many hours again? 53. 53, 53 uh, hours. Minutes for seven seconds. Ah, ah. 28 minutes and 14 seconds. 53 hours, 28, 28 minutes, minutes and 47 seconds. For seven seconds. Who will be telling me you're going to stop? <laughs> uh, we just had to stop. <laughs> I mean, who told you guys to stop? No one did, but we just had to. Okay, so yeah. well, we don't already know, say, we don't beat the previous record yeah, at that point in time. Yeah, but actually, when we actually did it, the previous record was 25 hours. But, and someone will not stop but, for 26 hours now. But, but in the process of trying to prepare all the documents, someone else broke it to 30 hours. Oh. So we were actually, we were actually blessed to have actually pushed it to 53 hours. So we still had the opportunity to also break the record. Because if we had done 26 hours, we would have, you know, so that's how we have to push it to the limit. So, wow. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much for coming to the studio. And we wish you the very best. Thank we know so this much. is just the beginning of very more, more, more opportunities for we will come your way. To enjoy more of this, our Ugon Get videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.